Command Sergeant Major Jones, Senior Enlisted Leader of the West Virginia National Guard here. I just wanted to take a minute to talk about the Army Combat Fitness Test. As you can, as many of you have already seen, we now have a final version. And if you haven't seen that yet, you're going to see it as we chain teach it down through the organizations and get down to user level. Um, there are just a few highlights. There's no longer a leg tuck. The plank is replacing it permanently. Uh, there are age and gender specific uh, standards now so many of you have have talked at length about that and the army has heard what you had to say so um, we've tried to get to the best point to really test the physical uh, aptitude of our soldiers and make it fair and equitable across the force and you know in the end it's all about demonstrating combat proficiency and doing the right thing for for our soldiers and making sure they're prepared for the rigors of combat. So uh, it's a good thing. I'm glad that we finally have a standard that we can stick to. But to point out the Sergeant Major of the Army, uh, SMA Grinston is having a town hall specifically targeting the National Guard. Um, April 7th, which is tomorrow at 1930. And we're gonna put the links and things out there on our social media platforms. I encourage every one of you to go out and take a look. There'll be a couple West Virginia Guardsmen that are going to have been selected to ask questions to the SMA. So uh, really good things. You'll get to hear from him how this process is laid out. And then you'll get to see him uh, provide some feedback as we ask him some very specific questions about the Army Combat Fitness Test. But I encourage each of you to, if you haven't seen it yet, to go out. It's out all over the place on Army uh, media and we'll push something out as well and start you know training and getting ready for it because uh, that's that's where we're at right now and uh, it's a really good thing so uh, that's all I wanted to take the time for so get training thanks